What's going on guys and welcome to a new video and in this video I want to discuss new business partnerships, new clients, how to handle them and you know what to do and definitely what not to do when you get a new client. Now when starting off you know you're excited, you've got this new client and you know you, you basically want to perform, you want to get results for this client um, but what you need to realize is that you know you are an expert okay and the reason for this video is because this was requested by um, you know someone through Instagram DM and basically this person was struggling with uh, dealing with the demands of the client and he felt like a more of a glorified virtual assistant rather than an actual agency owner and I just thought I'll create this quick video on this topic um, you know to make sure that everyone that is into social media marketing into digital marketing into you know creating like an online agency knows you know what they're worth is and that they you know basically that what you are worth that you sort of demand that with the clients or the potential clients or whatever okay so the situation was uh, they basically landed the clients um, and this client was demanding all kinds of websites landing pages and you know they were constantly updating and changing their opinion on what they wanted so they sent over a landing page um, and you know the landing page was then created by uh, the guy who sent me the message and um, then once he sent over the landing page back to the client the client wanted alterations and changes etc and um, you know he was basically asking for advice you know how to deal with a situation like this uh, guys like like i said you are the expert okay you are the expert in social media marketing digital marketing again you know regardless of what you are doing you are the person who his expertise are basically hired by that client okay so if the client um, you know makes alterations or wants things changing then it's up to you to basically put your foot down and tell this client that no you are the expert you are hired for your expertise and you are not some glorified virtual assistant or whatever okay and like you know i understand that when it's your first client or you're only just getting started it can be really difficult to say to a business owner you know this big boss of some kind of business um that you are not doing what he says but you are doing your own thing okay i understand that it's scary because you know first of all you know this is some kind of boss and you still feel like you know it's like imposter syndrome where you're not really 100 percent sure um that you know you're in the right place etc but you need to understand that you are also a business owner okay you are on the same level as him or her and at the end of the day you know you guys are both just human beings and what you need to do is work it out okay if you do not feel happy with the way you're being treated then you need to speak up because um, you'll notice that the client, the business owner, will respect you for that. And if he doesn't respect you for that, and you know he ends the relationship or the collaboration, then he wasn't a good fit from the start anyway. Okay. So if a client starts demanding things from you that you do not feel comfortable with, or wasn't the agreement, or you know he's constantly asking for alterations, you need to tell him the following. Just say to him in a polite way, you know, politically correct. Obviously, you know, always stay polite. Never raise your voice or shout at your clients because you know you are also a professional, and you need to just tell them. Listen, um, you know, what you can also even do, and what we like to do as well, is if we are not happy with the way you're being treated, we also mention that we've received complaints from the team. Okay, so we can say something along the lines of this: um, Hi, business owner name or client name. Um, we've received a few complaints from our team design team website team whatever you want to call it and um, you know I also have noticed that um, you know this relationship um, isn't being um, you know this relationship isn't in you know the right way or I feel like this relationship isn't on the same level as it should be um, I would like to reiterate that I am not or we are not virtual assistants we are not freelancers we are a professional agency and we do not like to be treated in this way um, you know, again, I'd like to reiterate that uh, we are professionals, we are um, experts that are being brought in for expertise and our goal is to get you, um, you know, certain results, X amount of results. Again, depending on what the client is, you know, get you X amount of leads, get you X amount of sales. Okay, that is what we are brought in to do. You know, although we appreciate the feedback, the whatever, the alterations that you are making and we understand that this is your business and you'd like to do it or you'd like to you know stay in control as much as possible but you do need to trust us on this okay then you can say something along the lines of if you do not feel that this is the way you want to run the business then we are more than happy to give you a refund and part ways okay you need to make sure that the business owner knows that you are willing to walk away from that deal more than they are you know willing to walk away okay because if you get the impression that you want the deal more than he does 
then he basically has leverage over you and then he will always be in control of you, okay? So you need to make sure that that business owner understands that you are a professional business owner as well and you know that you're basically creating a win-win situation by working together and you know if you are not happy with it that you are willing to walk away okay so i understand this video was relatively short but i just wanted to uh, basically record this video you know for the person who sent me that message and you know just give you guys a bit of an indication of what to do in a situation like this now guys with that said you know if you need specific coaching on that situation or if you know you just want coaching for your agency in general i have recently opened my uh, coaching program where basically for a small monthly fee i take you on as a personal client and i basically push you to the next level okay so i look at your goals and i basically push you in that direction so that you've basically got no other choice than to be successful uh, with digital marketing or we're in a money online okay now with that said you know obviously the spots are limited and that's no fake scarcity or anything like that literally you know my time i haven't got that much time uh, to you know individually coach uh, all these people so my time is limited you know obviously i do have my own agency myself i am not just um, you know, we're doing the coaching. So, you know, obviously the majority of my time does go to the, uh, my own agency and, and taking that to the next level. But, you know, I have the time to basically coach um, a few individuals and take them to the next level as well. Um, if you think you could be a right fit for this, then, you know, click on the link below. If you're unsure about it and you'd like a discovery call and, you know, and obviously no strings attached, but you just want to quickly uh, call with either me or my team to see, you know, if you are a right fit for this, then, you know, again, that is also linked in the description box down below. But for now, I'm going to wrap up this video. So like the video if you got some out of it. Comment down below what you'd like to see from this channel next. Subscribe to the channel for more. And I'll see you guys in the next one.